after the young sire, now we will talk about a proven sire, a star of the, uh, the rings, the cell rings, who is called Loman. Could you, everybody knows Loman now, but could you come back to the, f to the time when you pick him up? Yes, he was first brought to my attention by Paul Nataf when he was a two-year-old. And as you know, he only ran once as a two-year-old. He was very impressive when he won at San Clou. And Paul said to me, this horse, we believe, will be a champion next year. So I watched him very closely after that. And I followed his progress uh, you know, at each race that he ran. And uh, I was very, very impressed, of course, when he won the, the Prix du Jockey Club, which I believe is a very important race now. I think the distance of the race, the class of the race, um, as you know, we now have two Prix du Jockey Club winners in, in Bally Lynch. And uh, so I went to see him uh, at Jean-Marie Beguignes. And once again, I was very impressed with his physique. He's a big, powerful horse. After the Jockey Club? Uh, after the Jockey Club, yes, after the Jockey Club. And uh, in fact, it was after the Prix Jean Pratt. Okay. So I was impressed that he could win the Jockey Club and have the speed to drop back to the, the Jean Pratt and win that even more impressively. So he had versatility, speed and class and he had a, a fantastic physique. So I was very attracted to him. Um, we, you know, set about buying him. At the time, it was, it was the end of the, the last high part of the cycle, so he cost lots, um, but we created a good syndicate for him, and uh, he succeeded right from the start. He, he had, you know, very good horses from his first crop, like Most Improved, who was Group 1 winner at Royal Ascot in, in the, the St. James's Palace Stakes. Inutile de revenir sur, les, euh, sur la production de Loman que tout le monde connaît sur les pistes et puis aussi euh, sur les rings. En fait, l'histoire est la suivante. Euh, John O'Connor a été alerté par Paul Nataf sur la qualité d'un deux ans qui donc s'appelait Loman, totalement méconnu. Il avait couru qu'une fois deux ans, il avait gagné. Et donc du coup, John O'Connor a commencé à suivre ce cheval de près. Le cheval a gagné le Jockey Club, une course très importante pour lui. D'ailleurs, il y a deux gagnants de Jockey Club ici avec l'OP des Vegas, bien sûr, ici à Bally Lynch. Et il a été très impressionné par le fait que le cheval soit capable, après le Jockey Club sur 2100 mètres, de revenir sur 1600 mètres, montrant beaucoup de vitesse pour gagner le prix Jean Pratt. Et là, il a été le voir hyper impressionné par le physique. Il a fallu faire une offre, bien sûr, très importante, parce que le cheval avait tout pour lui, mais ils ont créé un bon syndicat autour du cheval et ils ont pu réussir à remporter le cheval. Et dès la première année, il a sorti Most Improve, gagnant des Sam James Palastex. Et puis après, bah, la suite, la suite, elle est à l'avenant.